Callaway United. And we're a, it's a fair, fair hike from the city, about two and a half. So Rod Baker is the president of Callaway. So first year as president. Yes, Rod, sir. let's first talk year. about um, why you did tonight's session and what you got out of the session. Too. We, uh, we had a look at where we're at with the club, uh, taking on the presidency, and I really wanted to engage the community to take it to the next level. I could see we had a tough year last year, and I was worried that I could end up running the club on my own. Yeah. And uh, so I, I met with the committee and a few, a few of the locals, and we talked about how we move forward. And I use the analogy that uh, we're a farming community here, and if farmers don't innovate, and change, um, the future's not looking real rosy. And so, there's no town here, is there? There's no town. Um, it reminds me of my club. <laughs> yeah, very much. There's a lot of synergies with uh, Coral Inn. Yeah. But um, what we got out of tonight was very much around that analogy. Um, I think it's given us the opportunity to innovate, move forward, and be successful. So, How many people? You had about 30, a bit 30, 40? Yeah, 30, 35 to 40 people here. Yeah, and, um, a lot of energy. Yeah, a lot of energy in the room. Um, just people pretty passionate about if you, if you break it down, it's it's actually, the football and netball is the excuse, but it's actually about having a community club. We, yeah. we can't go down the street here, meet someone from the milk, at the milk bar or the bakery. Our, our, our district revolves yeah. around the football and netball club. Yeah, and um, your, uh, was tonight what you thought it was going to be? Uh, look, Terry, um, it, I can't express what, what you've presented to us I, th I see it as a solution, but I see it as achievable too. Mm. The fact that you didn't try and set too big a target, um, th there's some other things that we can look at next year, but, but you broke that down into some key achievables for, for this season, and I think particularly the membership drive, um, yeah, yeah th there's potential to raise quite a bit of money. We've been, we've been well below our salary cap, and I think it gives us the opportunity to, yeah. to, to get a bit closer yeah. to that, which makes us more competitive in the league. Absolutely. So tonight, um, great to have good representation. You had some players there, you had your senior coach here. That's pretty important that they, they buy into yep. what you, you're trying to roll out as a community and a club. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Um, we tried to engage. There was people that played footy across previous decades as life mm -hmm. members. Um, no, we, we had pretty good, good engagement, yep. particularly from our netball club too. Yeah, right. So, and um, you're first year president, you, it's obviously you, you're in you're in boots and all, aren't you? <laughs> oh, yeah. And, and hopefully tonight gives you that roadmap. Yep, yep. Um, a pathway for you to, to, to move forward. I'm actually going to sleep a bit better than I, Terry. Um, <laughs> That's good to hear. Um, no, probably the key thing is I, I want to be in a position where I support the committee rather than the committee being there to support yeah. me. Yeah. So it's about leading the ship, um, yeah. having a good committee. Um, before I took the role on, I made sure that there were certain people that I knew would be good at the yeah. roles. Yeah. It was about the right people in the right positions. Yeah. Um, I approached them personally and said, I'll take on presidency if, yeah. if you take on that role. And um, I think we've got a really good committee to uh, move forward. We've got good engagement tonight, and I think we're really well yeah. set up. And great energy in the room. So, if you had any clubs that were thinking about something like this, what would you, in terms of not this is obviously a little bit of a sales pitch from my end, but yep. the value, the benefit you got to, to help you move forward? I, I think just just trust and embrace it. Um, with what I've seen with Terry, he, he's grassroots. He 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 knows what's worked, what's doesn't. He's heavily involved in his own local club, and it's right down grassroots community. Mm. He's as he said. The, these are concepts that have worked right up through to the AFL, but you break them down the community, and yeah. that works for community as yeah. well. And, but, um, and yeah. I, I can see that with what you presented tonight. Yeah. Good on you, mate. Thank you. Hopefully and, that's uh, <laughs> all good. That'll be great, mate. Appreciate